hey what's up everybody my name is karan and welcome back to my channel again my channel name is Zanapri. hope everyone is fit fine and take care of themselves so guys as you all know that jee applications for are released so we'll be discussing each and every details regarding that also in this channel we'll be trying to cover each and every detail regarding the dasa as well so if you had not subscribed yet the channel you can subscribe as well so at the left i'll try to show each and every details so let's get started Started. So as you can see now in here they had clearly mentioned the important dates right so first you can see the application dates are already started so the application for J means 2025 so this is already started and the people who don't know that mains will be happening in two phases one will be in the month of January and another will be happening in the month of April. Okay. Okay. So the first, as you can see in here, they clearly mentioned the last date is 22nd of the next month. So I would like to suggest that we have one month and uh, yesterday only the application started. So I would suggest like after one or two days, you can start, uh, you know, filling your application form. So this is the first important date, which I would suggest like you can take a print and you can put in front of your study table or wherever you want to do. So the second thing is, okay, correction of the particulars on the online application form. So firstly, I would say, I would say don't make any kind of you know error in your application form but in case in case if you do there is a correction window so no need to worry if you had submitted any details incorrect you can there will be a correction window and you can correct it again right and afterwards first week of january you will be getting that your where your exams will be so there are a lot of kids who will be filling like for like currently I'm deciding in UA for UA particularly I will tell you. So at your permanent address you have to fill India right and at your current address residential address you have to fill your current country like in whichever country you are living. Suppose you are living in Saudi, you are living in Oman, you are living in Qatar, you are living in Bahrain. So any of the country wherever you are living you have to fill that particular form the first thing. Second thing, if you want, you can fill the same address where currently you are residing, you can fill the same address in both of the places. So that will not make any kind of difference anyway. But the permanent address, if you can, if you want to fill, you can fill your home address and the current address, you can fill your currently wherever you are staying. The reason behind why I'm telling you is so you can get centers wherever you are staying currently okay so if you are filling both of the address of india you will not getting any center in uh, any other places where currently you are living so the better thing is you can fill at your permanent address you can fill your indian address and at your current address you can fill wherever you are living like suppose you are living in dubai abu dhabi so you can fill that particular address okay now the date of the exam date of the exam will be happening in 22nd to 31st there are some of the students who are thinking like why it's so long because a lot of students will be appearing and the exam will be happening in different different sessions okay so display of the question paper attempt by the candidates and the answer key will be displayed by the nta so this is the first session okay and now the second session is there so for the second session the application they will be started second session the exam will be happening in the month of april after your board examination okay so these are the dates for that again login window will open and you have to fill your application dates and all so and the last date for that is 24 2 once the first attempt will open then again the, uh, then you can apply for the second uh, attempt that will call as je may session 2 right it will be happening in april downloading of admit card each and uh, every day will be the like the same and one thing i would like to inform that best of two two will be counted okay suppose in one of the first attempt you score like 94 percentile and second you score like 92 percentile okay so best of the two means whichever will be higher that will be considered okay so i would suggest what you have to do you guys have to fill uh, a pf for both of the attempts a pf for both of the attempts and whichever is the best for that 
you know that will be counted so let's go a little bit down so for the architecture students also this is the option the exam will be for three hours right and the paper it will be a three hour test nine to twelve so again i'm repeating it is ist indian standard timing so you can match as per your country wherever you are siding right so there will be two shifts, first shift and second shift, shift like it will be happening and you have to reach at the center at least, I would suggest two hours before. Okay, that will be more good as per me. Now if you go a little bit down, so while filling the application form, now while filling the application form, here you can see center outside the Indian fee. So the kids who are residing outside the India, they have to pay 5000 rupees for the general boys candidate i'm talking for the female candidates as you can see 4000 and rest of the details are mentioned over here so the fee payment for the students who are residing abroad and the kids who are residing in india is different so you have to see it very carefully that the payment is different okay and these are the few details also so i will try to explain these details so basically in this detail one of the major one of the important details i will try to explain okay the first thing is while filling the application form for this january attempt you can fill for april as well okay so I would suggest you can fill the application for January and April both. Right? There is no need to, you know, to wait for the other attempt and, and right now you are filling for one attempt and later you are thinking that you will be filling for the other attempt. So better you can fill this. You can fill for both other attempts right now you can fill the application forms you can pay the payment because anyhow you have to pay uh, application form will be same but the payment you have to make so you can make the payment uh, at once and you you will you'll be you will be eligible for both of the attempts the first thing second thing is those kids who don't want to fill now so no issues in that case if you don't want to apply for second attempt for now you can apply later as well with the same application form which you had received for the first attempt okay so that will be the second case. Now what will be the third case? The third case is if you are not applying for the first attempt, then you will be eligible for the second attempt. Yes, definitely you will be eligible for the second attempt whenever the second attempt window will open. So as we have seen earlier, the second attempt window will be opening from this date. So whenever that date is uh, that uh, date will be uh, there, you can apply for the second attempt. So in all these three cases, you can apply for the JE mains. So these are the basic details which I told you or these are the dates which are there and which you should be, uh, you know, remember. So I will suggest take a print out of it, fill the application form and start your preparation if you have not yet started. And for the students who are already doing coaching somewhere, I will suggest that start revising the topics, which, uh, you know, uh, all the topics, the first thing in the month of November, your syllabus will be over and you should start revising all the topics. And also I will try to, uh, you know, uh, I will uh, suggest you guys, the best thing is uh, you should check all the previous paper, which you had given the first thing, check for the errors that whatever, whatever the errors or whatever, the question which you had done wrong earlier, make a copy for that, make a file for that, mark it all, uh, mark it, uh, mark all the errors or mark all the, you know, uh, uh, things that you are doing wrong in the examination, uh, make a copy for that, I would suggest and check frequently for that copy as well and start doing the revision. That's all from my side, guys. My name is Karan. If you have any kind of questions or if you are willing to join us, individual sessions, if you want with us, you can uh, you know put the link and you can click on the link and you can join our instagram uh, channel or you can join our whatsapp channel very normal charge i had kept it's all from my side guys my name is Khan. stay tuned stay safe step bye bye jai and jai bharat and as always god bless you all